this is Katie. She fell in love with Rob. He shook his hand and he said, go and have fun with my wife. Yeah. I mean, if that isn't a man. <laughs> the married couple are now in a relationship with Will and Dee. We sleep with Katie separately, we sleep with Rob separately, we sleep with them together. The group film their intimate lives for the world to watch. Some people like to be an accountant, some people like to be does. But their life choices have been picked apart online. This is so disgusting and disturbing. Hey. Oh, what I love about Katie, everything. She's just so easy to be around. She makes life so fun. And it's like having a sister, you know, but someone also you can explore sexually with and learn more about yourself in that realm as well. The best of everything. We became polyamorous after filming with Love Don't Judge. So today we're going to be showing you where we hold swingers parties. When we met Will and Dee, the relationship kind of just flowed from the start. It was our first swingers couple that we engage with. We sleep with Katie separately, we sleep with Rob separately, we sleep with them together. We have other people come over, like we've had big together. It's just, it's easy and it's comfortable and it's best friends. <laughs> I remember the moment seeing Katie cuddle up to Will and not be self-conscious and it was just a beautiful moment for us. It does confuse people when we're out. Work it, work it, work it. <laughs> <laughs> We'd be kissing and then we'd switch. So I'd be kissing Will and Dee would be kissing yeah. Rob and people are like, what did I just watch? Yeah. <laughs> okay, girls, no squats. <laughs> I think it's like if you get to choose your brother. That's pretty much what we've done. <laughs> yeah. We've chosen family. There's no jealousy. We trust each other and yeah, we've got a bit of a bromance going on. I think it's important. Honestly, it's probably one of the best choices that we've made in life. Go! <laughs> we've been able to quit our full-time jobs. We're living overseas. We get to spend all day together in paradise, all because of taking a step and doing something that other people judged us for. <laughs> so we're going to go back and we're going to film some promo content for our socials. Let's go! <laughs> all right, girls, how are we going? You ready for your photo shoot? Excellent. The content can range in the educational purposes of how to go on a girl, how to give a good kiss, as well as enjoying the spicy content that we all do together as well. Mm. We're swinging anyway, so why not just film it and make some money off it? Literally. <laughs> we found a lot more of the trolls generally tend to be on YouTube. This is a good one. People think swinging is a civilised way of cheating. Cheating is when you don't tell your partner or you do it behind your partner's back. Very big Swinging difference. is exactly it's like the whole us. Reason, yeah. Yeah, yeah, and you're open about, I'm going to do this or I did this, not being secretive about it. Yeah, it's a, a we thing, not a me thing. Mm. Hey. Mm. This is so disgusting and disturbing. Oh my God. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's yeah. this? You could have and other health problems from so many partners at the same time. It's not brave, totally not a healthy thing to do. I don't know what you're so proud of, good luck. You get lots of comments about like STDs and stuff like that, which I always yeah. find hilarious because we are the most tested group of people. We're a lot safer than your average hookup on a Friday night at a bar, yeah. honestly. So lame, hand over your man card, dude. Like, it takes a man to be <laughs> able to share their wife with someone else. The thing that really used to get to me early on was when people used to say that doing this would ruin our relationship. I've never been in a relationship with anybody and felt the way that I have with Will. It was nothing that I would ever do to compromise that what we're doing is right for us. And at the end of the day, that's all that matters. Most guys, especially, they've probably thought at some stage, oh, gee, I wonder if I could be a star. I know deep down that I'm on the right path. The biggest compliment, I think, is people ending up doing similar stuff to what we're doing and saying yeah. thank you for having the, yeah. yeah. They're like, oh, Katie, I had my first mm -hmm. People really are excited and then they see that from us as well. Will and Dee are a perfect uh, example of a couple that generally do everything together. And I guess we're just more open, like we've been in situations where I've picked up a, a guy for Katie. I work in 
So right from the very start, she knew before she met me that he's going to be with other people. We know what each other likes. So for example, we could be out or meet someone and be like, oh, that's the type of girl that Rob liked. We were out one night and I was getting along very charmingly with a 19-year-old. And you know, I had this fun, I was like, ooh, toy boy. Rob could see that I liked this guy and he shook his hand and he said, you want to come home with us? Yeah. And we all came <laughs> home together and yeah. he shook his hand and said, go and have fun with my wife. Yeah. I mean, if that isn't a man. <laughs> So I'm actually going on a date tonight and I have already spoken to Rob, asked him how he felt about it. And kind of being like wined and dined and dating other people. And I always bring that information home to the family, don't I? Yeah. <laughs> you look so good. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Look how hot he is. Oh, babe, you're going to have the best time tonight. <laughs> mm. We might have to share this one later. Oh, that would be fun. Mm. See you later. Have fun, baby. <laughs> I feel good about Katie going out on a date. I think that the whole point in our open relationship is that she gets to go and experience that, taking out to dinner and, you know, fine wine and dine as, as regularly as she wants. She is. She is. So I think, um, I think Tony's going to come over. Be interesting to see what he says. Yeah. But we've never really talked about the whole what he thinks about everyone. Yo, yo, what up? Yo, what up? Yeah. Chilling, chilling. So I guess, as you know, Katie and I see other people and, and now that Will and Dee have moved in, the four of us are kind of like one organism. What are your deeper thoughts on that sort of stuff? Yeah, that's, uh, that's adding another one to the mix. <laughs> it's hard enough dealing with one. <laughs> I don't know how you're gonna manage all that, but it's up to you, man. <laughs> well, I guess the plan is, is that they can help look after each other, right? You know what I mean? <laughs> It's kind of like when you have like one dog, you, you get another one so they can. <laughs> yeah. <there you> go. <laughs> Her being around other guys, going around town with other dudes, you're all right yeah. with that? There's been moments where I've had friends contact me. I just saw Katie, you know, walking on the beach with a guy, you know, and, and yeah. he was kind of surprised a little bit. I guess I'm not really the beach walk kind of guy, <laughs> so it just works. And, and most of the time, it's just like, Especially sexually, if she's doing something that makes me a little bit, oh, it's like, oh, I want to be doing that. Yeah, you know, yeah. like, can we, yeah, yeah. can you tag me in? Yeah, yeah. Could you see your, yourself dating three other people? Three girls? Yeah, why not? <laughs> <laughs> as long as they're cool, then I'm yeah. good. All right, buddy. All right. Take it easy. It. See you. Yeah. See you again soon. See you next time. Short term future for well, for Dee and I mainly is, you know, we're getting married next year. And having a swingers after party oh. at your wedding. Oh. So. Yeah. Just keep having fun. Yeah. That's big for me. I know what makes me happy and that's what I choose to do every day. You know, some people like to be an accountant, some people like to be stars. 